Hi folks, Buffin here with your Antifa News Brief for February 6, 2022. Facebook lost $260 billion, or $250 billion, so woo! Party time, excellent! Facebook lost a quarter of its uh, money. I don't think it's found it since then. It's, this, music, this news is actually, this music to my ears, this news is actually a few days old. Um, now, it maybe happened the day before yesterday. The entire stock market took a dive with it. Facebook losing so much money. Facebook being the biggest American company over a trillion dollars. It makes you think that what happened was Zuckster got it up to a trillion dollars because he, um, sorry for talking about that evil dude. Uh, he got it up to a trillion dollars because he wanted to like make that point and juiced it up that far that it wasn't nearly worth that or whatever and it fell back down. Really, I hope there's a sell-off and I hope it's worth nothing. And I hope that there that he goes away. That he I hope he goes to jail. I hope that you know it's better than losing twenty five percent of you. That's what used to happen to y'all in the old days. Get the head chopped off for that this kind of stuff. What Zuckerberg did was cheat us out of an election. Let Putin you know pay for all this stuff to get Trump elected into office. Cheat us out of democracy in the first place. Continues to do so, allowing the Trumpy stuff to continue on there. I was calling it out for years and being suppressed myself while seeing, you know, these people run rampant and seeing nothing ever be done to them for pushing lies about the Trump virus, pushing lies about, well, all sorts of stuff, pushing lies about Trump. Um, I'm sure he's right in there with trying to take over. I'm not on Facebook that much anymore, but, or ever, from last year, but I'm sure he's right up there with Trump about trying to retake the government, you know? So we've got to stop him, got to arrest Zuckerberg. It's what you would do for any other, like, crime lord like that. And you got to seize the company. Um, I feel like that Facebook becoming a public concern, like the, uh, the post office, you know, would be to everyone's best interest. People would be worried about the government having their information, whatever, they have it anyway. And why wouldn't you worry about Facebook having it when Facebook has proven itself to be evil? With our government, we can at least make our government transparent and good. It's the idea. We might not be living up to it, but the idea is to make the government transparent and good and fill it with us. If we don't like the government, we don't like us. If we like us, if we trust us, if we believe in us, we can make a good government. So let's do it, but part of that is season Facebook, because he's been letting Putin run our government for us. And for all sorts, and he's just stole $250 billion. He stole like, whatever, $25 million from Bono or whoever, you know? He stole it from all y'all, so let's get together and throw him in jail and take it over.